What's up everybody? What is a continuation of the Big Bass Quest? Still trying to catch one over six pounds. Uh, I caught one about three and a half here the other day, full of eggs. And I talked to another guy, he caught some big, big ones in a certain little place back here. But uh, I don't have time to do that today. So it's around 2.10 right now. I gotta be home at four o'clock. So I only got about an hour and 50 minutes to fish. Gonna be fishing with the KVD crankbait, silent 1.0 on my Shimano Corrado that I picked up not too long ago after I sold a lot of my stuff on my on my St. Croix Premier Rod. And uh, I got fluorocarbon on there, about 15 pounds. And uh, I'm gonna give it a little shot with that. And I got a lizard to drag over these stumps right here where I usually fish. And uh, hopefully we can get a couple uh, in a short time that I had to fish today. And uh, I caught something the other day and check that out right here. And then today will be right behind that, so. Sorry for the wind, and uh, stay tuned. Here we go, Tony. What's he talking about? Another, another nice one. Yes, sir. Look how white he is. Oh. Huh? Yes, sir. Another bass. Yeah. I hope I hope I get a few too. Oh, there we go. Solid fish. This thing's white. Yeah, you wanna bring him to that man over there? Mm -hmm. Watch out, he don't he ain't got no teeth. You gotta grab him good. Put your thumb in his mouth. Like that. Yeah, don't let him don't let him go. Let watch out for my pole. There you go. <laughs> They got like little bristle teeth, dude. Catch them on a crankbait, gotta love it. I thought he was a third at hook. Ugh. There we go, nice one. <laughs> I thought I was hung up. It's a bass, it is a bass. Nice bass. That's a big fish. That's a nice fish right there. Hey, I'm gonna try this to see how much the damn thing weighs. He's over three. Gotta be. Wonder if this thing's dead. I mean, it's been still moving. Oh no, I'm talking about that. That's dead. All right, got a good one. Got a good one. Got a real good one. Now this, hopefully it's a damn bass. Sure is. It's a good one. Try to keep him down. It look good at least from out there. He ain't that good. But it's a bass and I'll take it. There we go. Alright. Finally. After being out here forever, finally got one. Had a few follows and stuff like that, but nothing too serious. Good solid fish. Not the fish I want though. Tail died. Tried to weigh a fish the other day that was probably three and a half pounds. Don't really know how much big he was because scale yeah, wasn't working it was dead so got a new battery I guess this stupid thing's broken all right i'm gonna let you go give me a minute well here we go let's go get the stuff off of them a solid two pound fish get the release on this big on this sucker Get all the gray ass off his body. Oh, her body. One of the two. Ooh. Fat baby, though. Fat mama. Oh, fat mama done shook off right underneath the stump. Of course, my GoPro dies. I catch this nice three pounder. Damn thing's bleeding out the gills now, but I don't know. Give him a chance to survive, make some babies.
What's up, everybody? I hope you liked the video. Make sure to subscribe, drop a like, drop a comment. Thanks to everybody who's been subscribing to me lately. Make sure you hit the ring so you get updated with all the videos I come out with. I'm be coming out with all kind of stuff this year. I got some really, 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 really cool stuff coming. Uh, trying to catch a bass over six. Still trying to do that. All the bass that you've seen in this video were two and over. So I've been catching a lot of threes and they've been full of eggs. So hopefully this is a sign that my time is coming. I'm hoping it does because it's frustrating. It really is. But I'm just going to keep plugging along and keep trying to get them. And hopefully I get my hands on one and be able to knock it out of the park for you. So I can show y'all how stoked I'll be when I catch one. But uh, until next time, see you later.